This is the part where people really get hung up. I'm going to show you how you can add it to your story or to Instagram. And I'm going to show you from my phone first. I want to go to photos and point out a few things. I just exported a vlog from today. So you can tell where it starts because of all the little 15 second increments on here. Instagram, if you have this feature, will let you do 10 at a time. So I'm just going to share with you how I do it. I don't know if there's a better way to do it. I'm gonna go to Instagram. And now this is specifically for my story. So I'm gonna go to the top, hold my finger down, hit add story. Then I'm gonna go over here down here to where the pictures are. Now this is really important. You don't wanna start at the top. You wanna scroll down to where your fit first video started. And this is why I use headers. So I put happy Friday. And then you wanna click this little button up here. That little button up there is going to allow you to choose 10 clips at a time. I will tell you that I have had one person that I'm coaching and she doesn't have this button up there. I have no clue. We're still researching that. But you want to start here and go each clip and, and go to 10. So one, two, three, four. And Instagram has like you see the 10th clip right there, right? So then I'm going to hit next. And then, this is the fun part, you can swipe right and do a filter. Now again, this is just the way that I do it. So I go to each clip and put the filter on that I want to use. You can also just tap to the right to get to the next clip, like that. So you can pick the filter. Then I'll go back and, and again, this is just me but I have a note on my phone in notes where I keep hashtags. So I'm gonna go to the top here. I'm gonna swipe down. You see at the top where it says search. So I'm gonna type in the word hashtag. Usually it's right there at the top. So you'll see here how we have hashtags pretty much for every type of group, depending on my audience and who I'm posting to. And so these are key hashtags that I use a lot. So I just simply copy and paste. So for example, for this post today, I'm mainly focusing on content strategy, building my audience, connecting my name, Creativepreneur, Share Your Story, Collaboration, Entrepreneur Consulting. You can do up to 10 hashtags. So I'm going to copy that little area. And then I'm going to double tap or swipe whichever phone you've got. And I'm going to go and hit paste. Now, if you wanna make them small, you can hit return, make them smaller, and then you can move them into the corner, or you can pinch, make them bigger, smaller. I make them small. I might do the location. I might mention someone, do a hashtag. You can pull your audience, which is really cool. You can ask questions, you can do a countdown. So I'm going to say bright yay on this one and pinch it, move it around. And then I'm going to go to my next clip. And again, you can hit this to go to your next clip. Now let's pretend like I'm done. And then I'm going to hit next. And then I'm going to share it on my story. Now this video that I exported was more than 10. So I'm going to go back and do the same thing again. So I'm gonna hit this button. I'm gonna go down here and find and count up from 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. So I stopped here. So I'm going to go to the next 10, 
which again, Instagram will count it for you. So that's 10. And then I'm remembering that I'm leaving off with Deborah. I'm going to go next and same thing. I'm going to do the filter on each, which again, this is not a necessity. I'm going to go back to my notes. I'm going to copy my hashtags. I'm going to go back and paste them on each clip, make them smaller, get them out of the way, and then go up here and either, again, you can do location, you can do mention, hashtag. There's all kinds of fun things that you can do. So like I'll type in, uh, in the search, teaching, and then like there's cute, funny little things. So I may choose something, move it over. That's how you do that. So then again, I would hit next. Now, if it does that, you want to be on the last clip and it's touchy sometimes. So just hold down to next and then share on your story. Something else that I want to mention too is that you can link up here that link to an IGTV video, which we often do, or you can also write on this just like you can on Blog Easy, or you can type stuff out. So I love this because you can do a CTA, a call to action, before putting it on your story. Now, to conserve storage, I go back to my photos, okay? Back to my photos, and I hit select, and I delete all of this stuff. And I try to potty train my brain to do it every single day so that I don't have to worry about space filling up on my phone. 